Hey everybody, Nald Waffman here. I wanted to show you my latest backyard project, and that is my uh, chickens here. We made a, well, we, I didn't make the coop. I bought a coop online uh, through Craigslist, and we made a dedicated run. Part of the reason is because there are hawks everywhere, and this has done a really good job of keeping them out. Um, I'm just using the wildlife netting over here, and I have to add some more over here just to keep them coming in through the side. But that's the cats who are absolutely loving watching this. I'll show you real quick what's going on. All right, so we've got the actual coop. It was made by a local carpenter in the Tampa area. He did an awesome job. And these are the six chickens. Uh, four are definitely pullets. One of them is a cockerel. And the leghorn right there, I have no idea uh, because <laughs> It looks like a rooster it doesn't act like one so we're waiting to see what happens but this one my wife named big mama she's definitely bigger than the other ones and like my shoelaces apparently uh, that's pepper that's a barred rock it's the one i originally wanted to have we haven't named this one yet since we don't know its sex but right now i'm just calling it caitlin jenner and then of course we have stetson the rooster and he is gorgeous he's also been pretty quiet every time he crows that's Sylvia over there. Sylvia looks like one of those sassy ladies at church with the funny hats, and that's why we named her that. And then, uh, let's see, where's the other one? Ah, oh, there's Powder right there. So three of the hens, or three of the chickens, and that's Stetson, the unnamed one yet, and Powder we named, uh, we raised since they were only two days old. One of them, unfortunately, we had to put down because her tendon got completely torn off and recovery would have been slow and psychologically painful for the animal. So yeah, it's a really nice wide area for them. We're probably gonna get a second coop over on that side uh, with uh, hens that are already one, at least, you know, one year old. So this way, while these are maturing to lay eggs, these are already laying eggs and we can cycle back and forth. This was a run that was part of the coop, but now we just have it there just so they have an additional hiding spot uh, in case he does crow to let him in case he does crow to let him know that there is a hawk or anything nearby. Uh, we've got this branch that I cut from that tree over there. It's a little roosting area as well as one over by that stuck stuck in that part of the fence. And every now and then they'll also roost on top of that box too. Here, let's I'll open this up so you can see the coop. There's a coop there. My wife's already put uh, hay and everything just for them to warm it up and they dirty up pretty quickly it's also got a lamp on a timer and I'm also gonna be putting this door soon enough on a timer as well but yeah that's the chickens thanks for watching